My day is really intense, but I love it. Since I was uh, six years old, I started with soccer and it became uh, something that I love. In the morning, I wake up pretty early every day. Uh, I try to get into the rhythm. And most of the times I do my homework as well in the, in the early mornings because I feel like I'm more productive. Usually my breakfast is made by uh, eggs, bread, and so that I will have energy for the day. After I just go to the gym here and work out. Normally I listen to music walking in just to get myself in the mindset. And then it's the training room, it's foam rolling, stretching, just preparing the muscles, getting a good warm up in before walking outside. We train every day uh, for two hours on the field. It's a lot to ask for your body. If you take a little bit more time to, to take care of your body before and after practice, it helps me really to stay fit and to perform the best I can on the field. The training room, honestly, it's spectacular. I can't even tell the difference between which was the pro team and which was the college team. We got an ice bath, we got a hot tub, uh, we got a lot of machines for recovery. Uh, before training, after training, uh, and, and Steph is always walking around here taking care of us. Down there in the clinic, uh, we like to say that's where the magic happens. You know, it's not the place that you don't want to be. The amount of support Steph can give you, it's really incredible what she can accomplish. Basically trying to be the puppeteer of a functioning organization that can uh, provide for student athletes but also create an environment in which they actually want to be in. We're going on our third year now with the GPS uh, units for soccer. It's provided us and afforded us the opportunity to get more information about our athletes and then really kind of get some more buy-in with our athletes as far as, you know, why we're doing what we're doing. Having access to that information and then sharing that with the coaches allows us to you know, modify the training schedule uh, during the week. Uh, it allows us to look at athletes as far as what their, maybe what their norms are for, for output, what these athletes are going through, you know, what their workloads are going through, how do we manage their workloads, especially for maybe incoming freshmen that aren't used to the volume of play and the volume of practice that we do. It helps the coach so much to see like the effort, the tracking, and so it helps them create like game plans or strategies as well. Part of the reason why I came here is so I can combine soccer uh, with school. Obviously, like the main goal uh, for me is, is to become a professional soccer athlete, a soccer player. And that's what I'm working every day for. Uh, but at the same time, you never know what's going to happen in life. And so it's really important to just stay disciplined and maintain your grades because the USF and the NCAA has high expectations, not just on the pitch, but off the pitch. I need to make sure my grades is good enough to be in this amazing school. So the library is the place for me to go and study. When we don't have practice or, or later at the day when, when school is done, most of the times what I do, I go home and chill out a little bit with my, with my roommates. You know, just hanging out with them and just, just relaxing and get our minds off soccer and school is, I think, really really nice to do and I think it really helps us as well to recharge. So at the end of the day usually uh, I just sit with my friends in the living room, we play FIFA. Or just relax, take it easy at home because like I said at the end of the day we're all just humans and that comes first too. For us to combine such a busy schedule is, is, is tough sometimes and I believe that's the experience that uh, I had from soccer and school will help prepare me for the future. It also uh, really helps us to learn how to how to plan, how to schedule things. This opportunity you get at being a student athlete will help you out so much in the outside world, help you just manage connections and also the skill set that it requires and the discipline it requires to be a student athlete is something you can carry out throughout the rest of your life.